improve your aiming. What you want to do is I got this handmade right here, right? Most of you, you probably got a crosshair that looks like this, and most of you probably fight like this, right? What you want to do, you don't want to... First things first, you don't want to aim your gun, because it slows your movements, right? If you're fighting a fast-pacing target, you want to be able to get as much movement as you can, and get a bigger view of your surroundings. So what I would recommend doing is... I don't want to press that button. Most of you, your third person probably looks like this, right? What you want to do, if you're on console, hold... I'm on PlayStation, right? So I'll tell you how to do it for PlayStation. You want to hold in your touchpad, and you want to pull back the right analog stick like this, right? And you'll zoom out in third person. So now you got a better view of your surroundings, and you can move quite fast, too. And what you want to do... First of all, sensitivity does help quite a bit, so come in here to your settings. That's not the right one. Display. This is your sensitivity settings. This changes how fast you can move your camera like this. And you want to find the best setting that suits you best. And also, the mods for your weapon itself do also help a lot. What you want to do is, here I'll show you what mods you want on your weapon. Let me grab this. My weapon is very bugged because I can't even read the legendary effects on it. But what you want to do, you want to put whatever mod increases your hip fire accuracy, like this one right here, plus 25% hip fire accuracy. You want to get all the mods that increase your hit fire accuracy. So the true, the true mods usually do that. Here I got a 25% hit fire accuracy. Um, if you want an automatic weapon, you want to find the automatic receiver that increases your hit fire accuracy. Because the true receiver over here is a uh, single fire. It's not automatic. So right here I got the focused. And for the stock, most of you probably run one of these two because it increases your durability. While you could sacrifice accuracy for durability, I wouldn't recommend it. If you got a bunch of repair kits, swap to the true stock here, which gives you 25% more hip fire accuracy. And the magazine doesn't really change how you aim or your accuracy all that much. But it would be, you don't usually want to run with uh, drum magazines because it has a slow reload speed. It might, may have a high ammo capacity, but it has a low reload speed. So I would recommend actually doing this one because it's, it's bugged right now, but you can't, so you can't see the effect, but it has 40% armor penetration on it. And standard sights here what i've you want to figure out what helps you the most the circle or the dot because with sniping long distance targets the i found out that the dot does help the most and the muzzle depends on what you want the most you could use a bayonet you could use a compensator and a muzzle brake here to reduce your recoil or you can just run a suppressor like what most people do, and I'm going to do that. Um, actually, I did mess something up right here. So you do see how this mod says plus 50% recoil. You don't want that. You want to lower your recoil as much as you can while raising your hip fire accuracy as much as you can. So I would actually recommend the two short barrel here for less recoil while keeping the same hip fire accuracy. So now if I exit the bench, you can see that the hip fire accuracy has shrank a lot. So I'm going to use my camp module here for demonstration. I'm jumping around, and as you see, I got pretty good accuracy. But if you're in first person and aiming your gun, you have really slow aiming. So if you're trying to move around and dodge bullets in the middle of a fight, won't help that much 
And if you're in first, you only want to be in first person when you're sniping long distance targets because it helps you focus them. But uh, otherwise, you don't want to be in first person because it lowers your field of view and it slows you down. And also, something else that does help a lot is certain weapons have a perk that increases your hip fire accuracy. For this handmaid here, what you want to do is you want to use this perk in here called. Let's see, where is it? Where is it? Ground Founder, right here. Rifles have 30% faster, or reload 30% faster, and have actual. Excellent hip fire accuracy and what you want is that because of the hip fire accuracy and now you see That those crosshairs are even smaller than they were previously And actually Let me show you a different weapon you can do this with um, A weapon used a lot by most people weapon called the cold shoulder Let me see if I can craft one real quick there it is. Just gonna craft the standing cold shoulder. And they should see that the crosshairs are quite big. So you will miss a lot of your pellets. But here's how to fix that. What you wanna do, go to your workbench here. Go to the cold shoulder. Put on the true receiver for more hip fire accuracy. You want to put on, let's see, not the true long barrel because that increases your recoil. You Not the sawed off barrel because that also increases your recoil. But instead you want the true short barrel because it reduces your recoil. And for the stock, unless you want more, I guess, yeah. While the true stock here does increase your hip fire accuracy, the precise stock increases your durability and your hip fire accuracy, so you might want to go with this one here. I would recommend doing the dot for the sight. And for the muzzle, it doesn't really matter. I'm not going to put any muzzle on it. And now look at the difference that's made. Look at how small those crosshairs are. Now you can actually make these crosshairs even smaller by swapping on a little perk called Skeet Shooter. Let me see if I have it here. Yes, I do. Perk called Skeet Shooter. Your shotguns have excellent accuracy and spread. And now you see this thing is very accurate. And it is pretty easy to aim with. Unlike what it was previously. And that. And that. Is how you. Can. Help improve your aim and accuracy.